An IOC, or an indicator of compromise, is like a clue. It's a little bit of data, um, kind of like a breadcrumb left behind on the forest floor of your IT department. So many times, a SOC or a security operations center will get word of a new or evolving threat or, or, or be, be asked to do some research that says, hey, what is the impact of CVE XYZ and should we be concerned? So with this indicator of compromise, the SOC or the threat researcher can actually um, search for um, that breadcrumb throughout their organization. This is, uh, the searching is called sweeping for an IOC and EDR solutions, Endpoint Detect and Response Solutions, will allow that sweeping and a correlated report that will, that will give your stakeholders a, uh, a, a bill of health or, or a true assessment of the scope of this threat or impact in their organization. Sometimes it's a check mark that says, hey, we're good, we found no trace of it. Sometimes it, it leads to a more detailed uh, root cause investigation or uh, further action. So patient zero. After an IOC, indicator of compromise, or a new threat is found, it's, it's important to very quickly and accurately identify the first infected endpoint. Using the flight recorder or, or metadata, we'll actually sweep for that IOC or a hash and determine the number of endpoints that were actually impacted by that threat before it was deemed to be suspicious. Because then you'll have the whole population of endpoints uh, that, that might um, have caused trouble in your environment or could be the source of recurring events once you do an initial cleanup.